Today's video, the problem is from review of probability. So using multiplication theorem or conditional probability, we are going to solve this. So now we have to determine probability of B given A and probability of A given B complement. If A and B are the events with probability of A is equal to 1 by 3, probability of B is equal to 1 by 4 and probability of A union B is equal to 1 by 2. So this is the question and this is the information given. P of A is given, B is given, P of A union B is also given. And it was asked to determine P of B given A and P of A given B complement. See here, let's get started. So solution. What is given here? P of A is equal to 1 third and P of B is equal to 1 fourth and P of A union B is equal to half. So first of all, according to the definition, so we need probability of A intersection B. So what is this A intersection B? That is probability of A plus probability of B minus probability of A union B. So probability of A is nothing but 1 by 3. This is 1 by 4 and this is minus half. If I take 12 as LCM, then this will be 4, 7 minus 6, that is 1. We got probability of A intersection B as 1 by 12. Now, the first question is we have to find out probability of B given A. From the conditional probability, probability of B given A is nothing but first we have to intersect these two. Probability of A intersection B divided by. There is an easy way. So, in the denominator there is A. So, there will be probability of A here. So, this is according to the conditional probability. B given A is nothing but. So, first intersection of these two and denominator is A here. Therefore, there will be probability of A like that you remember. So, what is probability of A intersection B? This is 1 by 12 and probability of A from the question is 1 third. So, after simplifying this will be 3 by 12 which is equal to 1 by 4. Therefore, probability of uh, B by A is equal to this value is 1 by 4. And next question here is probability of A by B complement. So, according to the conditional probability, first we have to intersect these two, that is A intersection B complement divided by. So, what is there in the denominator B complement? So, there should be B complement here, that is probability of B complement. So, first I need this value, that is A intersection B complement. A intersection B complement is nothing but P of A minus P of A intersection B. So, P of A is 1 by 3 and P of A intersection B is uh, 1 by 12. P of A is 1 by 3. So, all the values are ready here. So, after simplifying, we got the value of P of A intersection B complement value as 1 by 4. So, now we have to substitute here and we need B complement. So, how will we be getting B complement here? So, B complement is nothing but 1 minus P of B. So, what is P of B? From the question, we have P of B is equal to 1 by 4. See here, after substituting 1 by 4, so P of B complement is equal to 3 by 4. And now the second question, see here, the second question, the probability of A given B complement from conditional probability is. So we have to intersect these two by denominator, probability of B complement. A intersection B complement just now. So the value is ready here as A intersection B complement is equal to 1 by 4. And B complement is equal to 3 by 4. So the answer here is 1 by 3. So this is how we will get using the conditional probability. And this is also so simple if you understand this one. See probability of B given A is nothing but the formula here is we have to intersect these two. That is probability of A intersection B by what is there in the denominator A by probability of A. Here, in this case, so we have to intersect these two. That is probability of A intersection B complement. See here, A intersection B complement by probability of B complement. So, this is how we have to remember and substitute. And uh, we have to substitute all the values to get our resultant. Thank you so much for watching. And I will be uploading many more uh, problems related to this series. Have a look at those. And th those will be enough for your preparation. Thank you so much.